Hello everyone, it's me, the Below Average Gamer, and thank you for joining Below Average Gaming. I appreciate you coming and watching me play this video. We are playing Nyctophilia, a game by Dennis Yabachdinyaknuknyak, and i um, super excited. I've never played this game before. If you look, you see that my continue is able to light up. Let me just explain real quick. I've had some issues trying to set this up with recording and audio stuff. That's the only reason that's going, is because I started playing it, realized that it wasn't recording. All I got into was it pretty much giving me some credits. So, just to be safe, I'm going to go ahead and hit new game, and let's play! Super excited. Nyctophilia, a love or darkness, or, or a love of darkness or night, finding relaxation or comfort in the darkness. Spooky. So, from what I've read about this game, um, it's supposed to be you, as this character, trying to forget something, and you're in this house, or you're doing something crazy. I don't, um, fully understand kind of the description. Like I said, we're gonna be learning as we're playing. But, yeah, it's supposed to play on my own thoughts and my own idea of what I think is happening. So it should be really exciting. Use the arrow keys to move. Here I go. Super exciting so far. I don't know what that texture is behind me if I'm in smoke or if I'm in like a cave or something or what's going on there. I see I don't have- are those my eyes, or are those my eyebrows, is my concern. See, I'm a guy with very thick eyebrows, so my first thought is that those must be my eyebrows. I hear something coming from behind me. Oh, okay, um, hello, is this the doctor? I can't move. Um, oh, good, nyctophilia. So we're in the game now, we're officially in the game. Day one. So this is uh, gonna take place over a couple days, I'm guessing. What the hell kind of dream was that? Press X. That dream. The dreams never get better. It's time to leave this hotel. To view your items. I don't Are you checking out? Trying to. Nice day today, isn't it? I guess. I don't know. Have you seen my any tall people recently? I guess these are their eyes. Cause that guy has him like where his eyes should be. This guy just has eyes really high up. He doesn't even have like a forehead. He has like a one head or a two head. I'm gonna go to bed so I can try to continue with the storyline. I won't sleep here. The wallpaper depresses me. Whose idea was it to use this design? There. He's going to sleep now. Perfect. Nothing spooky. Nothing creepy happening yet. Day two. Easy. Day one was fantastic. I would assume that day two is gonna be just as easy. I started out the day not existing. That was pretty interesting. I didn't know that I was going to be playing a walking simulator. I'm having a ball. A friggin' ball. In fact, I'm having two of them. I'm having two balls. Oh, look. I'm terrified. Man. Ooh, is that the sound of the ground? Oh, no. Ooh, this guy's got to watch out for that dude that I guess his lady's talking to. Honey, I've been thinking about what's going on between us. I hope you will forgive me and we can begin to live again as a happy family. I want to believe that. I just really need to sort things out. Man, uh, this guy is losing his lady. He's got to take care of some biz. Oh, look, it's that wall again. Locked. Whoa. Oh my goodness, I'm a nerd now. What have you done to me? Who's, what? Why is she so much more defined as a character than I am? I'm literally a square and she is like a fully formed like curvy woman is this his lady i know you okay still unsure but i don't remember who you are okay damn it janet i love you some sweet sweet romance day three all right um crowbar it was in the stupid box! Why didn't I take that before? Why did I just leave that there? It's a crowbar! Did I not think that that might be important later? Empty space. I got it. I'll use the crowbar. I'll use the crowbar. I will use the crowbar. Wow, there's a room! Why the hell? Why was it hidden? Perfect. Can I go in there now? Oh, wow! It looks like some kind of office. Worth seeing. New goal. What is it? Look at the office? I'm going to assume that that means to go to the barn. Because one of the letters I remember him talking about the barn. Saying, I'm doing some crazy stuff back here. Don't let anyone in. Shh, it's a secret. 
So I will do it. Cool. I broke the crowbar. Now I can. I broke the thing in there. Whoops. Come on. Take me back in. Woo! There's another letter on the ground. That's spooky. Let's go in there. Double spooky. Triple spooky. No, it's just one spooky. I'm just walking. Do something interesting, please. Ah. I'm I want to keep walking straight. Please. Uh. I can't just look at the map and figure out where I am. I have to like either go back or don't go back. What are these two doors? Uh. Here I go. Look, it's another door. I'm gonna pass it. Ooh. Some sort of table. It looks like a well. Well. Bottom is not visible. I hear no sounds. Oh, it's the tall man. It's the doctor. Who are you? How did you get here? People are not what they seem. What the hell? But you know that's what he's thinking. Return to the beginning of the map. Press X. Oh look, I'm back in Nightmare Land. I should have read that. I keep hitting the button by accident. Oh, uh, maybe I can light bulb. Oh no, I don't like that at all. Uh, get me out of here. Um, things are taking a turn for the worse. Three, two, 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 two. Oh, I don't like that. Um, I want to go back this way. I you're... no. Let's see where we're going. I'm excited. <gasps> well, is everybody ready? Hey, it's your line. Are you with it? Okay, so they are waiting on my line. Um, hark! What yonder window breaks? It is the east. And Juliet is the sun. See how she lays her hand upon her cheek. Oh, how I wish I was a glove upon that hand so that I may t oh. If it's brown, flush it down. If it's yellow, you know, you gotta leave it mellow. It actually works. Hooray! What is that on the screen? Is it me? What is this? Oh, a red uh, floating glowing square. How fantastic. This is exactly what I was looking for. I'm glad I was able to find it in the attic where it belongs. Because I put it here. Because that's what I wanted. Ah yes, I am not at all surprised by this giant floating eye. Because I knew all along that this giant floating eye would be here. And I knew what it was going to do next. That is how, what he know, well, how he knows what to do now. It was the eye. The eye he's like, oh, now I know what I'm supposed to do. Barman. Hey, man. What's his voice? Hey, want a drink? Is what he said. He's permanently drunk, is my character I'm doing for him. Yes, I say calmly and carefully. 
I'll be here a while. <laughs> Looks like I made a new friend. And it's dark. What happened? I am not for this plan. I don't like this plan. I don't like this guy. I don't trust him. Hey, we're closing now. You gotta go. I know one place. You knew one place before, and you went to a bar, and then when you left, she was there, and then she was gone. Where? Tell me more, you cryptic, cryptic human being. You piece of human, literal human garbage. Literal human garbage. What are we doing? What is the plan here? And this is, oh, this is the restroom. Oh, the eye is the eye is the toilet. Bro, that's how you get pink eye. That's how you get like seriously. That's how you get like red eye. Like if you just poop directly into the eye. Oh, the moon. The moon. The moon looks beautiful tonight. Look at the moon. And the moon looks back at you. Oh. I should leave. Jacket club. We all have jackets on. What's that? Is there someone at the door? Maybe I should not move and just continue to stare back and forth. Like some sort of idiot. Just look at the door. Then look at the lady. What is happening? What are you doing? Do I oh, I can walk. Looks like I'm staying after all. Apparently I made a decision. Her life really began at night, and I need to sleep at night. Ah, oh, it's the end of the game. So I guess I never get to the basement. This is the cellar, or yeah. Weird. That was an interesting game, I think. I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, it was really boring. I'm sure if I paid attention, I might have gotten a little bit more out of it. Maybe if you watch this video on, like, no sound, you might be able to understand. Or maybe you played it with sound and you're like, this is one of the most beautiful games I've ever seen in my life. It's amazing. But I just couldn't get into it. I turned the music down, as you can tell, so you can hear me talking. Which may have been an issue. Maybe the music was a huge part of the game. I don't know. I'll never know, probably, because I'm probably not going to play the game again. Uh, it was, it was okay, uh, I can't even say that. It was not a good game. I mean, yeah, like, I, I played a lot of the music. Maybe the music, maybe the music is the driving force. Maybe I'll play it with the music on and everything. Maybe that's the driving force to the whole thing. But, I don't know. Things just seem, like, they're trying really hard to make it deep. It was the whole thing of, like, you have to save her. You have to save her! Uh, and then it didn't happen, and it's like, oh, yeah, you know, whatever. There's a psychologist now. Ooh! Nyctophilia Infinite. What is that? Is that the next game? Is that the game that's gonna come out if this one went well? So, in other words, is that the game that's never gonna come out? Man! I am so confused. I've never been this confused in my life. Did I play that game? Did I not? Was that the poll meaning? Was that I can look back just like the guy and I'm like, man, did that really happen? I don't know what to do. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching the Below Average Gaming channel. Um, I'm your host, the Below Average Gamer. I am so sorry. Uh, I don't understand this game and it frustrates me. Um, thanks for checking out the channel. Like and subscribe, or don't, or check out the other videos. Please check out the other videos. Um, it's going to help me go ahead and get the next program started with um, the Below Average podcast coming up soon. I believe that I'm recording that on Tuesday. Hopefully. If not, it'll probably be pushed to Thursday, which I don't want to do, but I may end up having to do that anyway, because the person that I'm recording with might not be available until Thursday. But hopefully uh, Tuesday, I'll be able to get that out to you. I'm really excited. I hope that you're excited too. It's going to be a lot of fun. Um... Yeah, thanks for checking out the channel, thanks for watching the video, and you the best. Bye. I enjoy playing it. Nice, creepy story and design, covered by a really good soundtrack, but walking around in the catacombs sucked. Good horror game, I highly recommend it. It really messes with your head. A very specific ending to the person enjoys seeing Topher Grace smothered in nectar. 
<laughs> so it's, it's a very vague type of storytelling that makes the gamer hope for a shocking revelation to make it worthwhile, but that doesn't happen. <laughs> I usually like pixelated and suspenseful games, but this is literally just a waste of time. Oy, man, I'm tired, so tired. So, so tired of low-res walking sims. I think this game looks interesting. Might be worth your time. But hey, it's free! Yeah! Might be possibly worth it! Prove me wrong, please. Make it a good game. Please, someone play this and make it seem good. Thank you. Please. I'm begging you, please.